Area restaurant, bar, and hospitality workers, this one's for you. The Business Resource Center of Terra State Community College is offering several training and certification courses starting this month. This afternoon, we have Carolyn and Emily with us to tell us more. Uh, this is Carolyn, this is Emily. Thanks for coming in today. Um, until I was reading a material here, I didn't realize what serve safe and tips training even was. Uh, kind of tell me what this is. Well, um, Emily is going to be the instructor, one of the one of a number of instructors from Terra. But um, serve safe and um, tips training are for um, food servers and as well as the kitchen staff, the culinary staff, and um, your bartenders. So. Um, basically, it's a hospitality training that normally costs them approximately $200 um, if a business were to pay for an individual to go through this training. And um, Tara is offering it for free through our Business Resource Center. So the, let's start with the, uh, the serve safe. So if you're a server, you go through this training, get certified for it. What is it you learn to do? So the serve safe stuff, serve safe manager is majority for all of your managers in restaurants. Okay. Um, the person in charge, which is what servers and anybody other than the manager would take, and that will give them knowledge and experience, but not as much knowledge as the manager would have. So that's why we're offering the serve safe manager along with person in charge, because both those are certifications that restaurants and um, the hospitality industry needs. What are some particular skills that you need to have to be a manager, or what would you learn in this training? You would learn like the different, the quality control, the temperatures, the cleanliness of your kitchen, basically making your health inspections be okay. flawless. So it's going to help with that and it'll make a better, um, just a better quality and great customer service I for your restaurants. Be, I would think it'd be really difficult to, to, to run a restaurant because there's so many variables, uh, you know, bacteria, you got to mm -hmm. keep it constantly clean. You got to worry about rodents. Uh, I mean, and that, oh, yeah. And how, how often do health inspectors show up? Like only if you're on their radar kind of, or they so kind they of- So they come out every six months. Okay. And if you have a violation, they come out again. So this will help with that. Reduce all of your violations by having them go through these trainings. Okay, then, then the, the tips training, um, when you explain what that is, because once I heard what this was like, oh yeah, you gotta have that. So, so bartenders, many times people think, oh, bartending's an easy job. Oh no. no. <laughs> <laughs> and, and we know, we know it isn't. Um, and so what this does, it just, it, it, it teaches them the hospitality aspects. We have a um, seasoned bartender that's also instructing with um, Emily, and we also have a um, seasoned chef that's, that's instructing on the serve safe, but basically it teaches them the same types of things, but for bartending. Um, cleanliness, um, you know, wh what you do, temps of water, how you clean dishes, there's, there's systems and routines to everything to make for a, a cleaner, um, more safe kitchen and bar. Well, Emily, if, if, you're, if you're a bartender, uh, well, your establishment has to have a liquor license to yes. operate. Yes. And this is a process to, so everybody that works for me, tending bar, must have this certification? Yes, so majority of um, liquor permits, you also, your bartenders have to be TIP certified in order to meet the regulations and the standards for your liquor permit. So that's why it's even, even better um, for us offering it free because it gives all these area um, restaurants and bars the opportunity to have them all take this class so they are all meeting the guidelines and regulations that the liquor permit has. Well, one thing's a liquor permit to, to be able to, to serve alcohol, but also uh, to get your your uh, insurance. Yep. So you've got to be certified so that, that the, yep. the company that you're paying for insurance, they're satisfied that your staff is, is uh, doing it properly. Yes, it reduces the liability too. So having them all tip certified, it gives them the knowledge and the skills um, to serve alcohol responsibly. That's got to be difficult, does it, to, to, uh, to judge whether someone's too drunk to yeah. be to be in there. There's there's signs that they can look for, um, and you also don't want underage drinking too. That's another thing that you really want them to be well trained so they don't let somebody slip through the cracks and end up with a major violation. Not only would the establishment be or could be um, fined, but also the individual. 
Well, let's take a look at, again. What are the dates of this uh, this training that you have? And this is free. This is really nice. This is free. Um, we're planning on doing more trainings, um, but we still do have openings in the current um, the current upcoming trainings on uh, January 15th through 16th, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. on both those days. Um, we have the Serve Safe Manager training, and then Serve Safe Person in Charge is January 22nd from 8 to noon. And then the next Monday, we have um, the tips training for the bartenders and servers. And this is all paid for by the federal government? Yes, the USDA has given Terra um, State Community College a grant for the Business Resource Center, and that grant has established all kinds of trainings for small businesses, entrepreneurs starting up businesses, and this is one of the things that um, we have, have focused on specifically for rural areas. So your, your Sandusky County, Erie County, uh, Seneca, Ottawa County, it's kind of, it's kind of um, focused on those areas, um, but um, you know, we, we wanna make sure that they have the same um, opportunities that everyone else has throughout major cities. Great opportunity there. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much, Carolyn and Emily, for coming in today. Thank, Thank you. you. Amar's